time we are back with mm. more Witcher. We fight. Where are we going? I do what they pay me to do. That's it. Mm-hmm. Isn't that how world works? Yep. Unless you want more money than you do over work. Ponies. You look a lot skinnier than Roach. Roach is big buff northern lady. Big buff. I come from the north. Where elephants speak Norse. Is this like, what did the fox say? Maybe. Mm-hmm. There we appears got big to be a rocky troll. Boys. Big rocky boys. Are they friendly? Perhaps. Or are they infected? Or whatever they're called. Yep, they're rapid. Are you pussies? What does it say talk? I'll talk to them. No, no. Yet they don't want to talk. Oh god, the bleeding's doing so much. Yeah, I guess it's the axe. Polishing? Poison. Ah. 1700 damage with that strong strike. Another one. You just stay back there, okay? No. That and a little bit of that. Sure, whatever. Trolls are cool only if they don't attack me. Troll Lipper. Poor boy. False teeth. Maybe the trolls want that some false teeth. <laughs> you want me to come all the way out here just to go back? Well, you know, life. It's like when you're visiting a store. You go there, buy stuff and come back. I mean, that's how it works. Unless you use their services, then no. Because you can also go to their website, pick which items you want and they deliver it to your doorstep. But that usually gives like extra money. So if you buy like stuff for like 20 bucks, it would cost like 23 instead. Just delivery cost. Wow. But hey, you don't have to move. <laughs> I've lots to do before it gets dark. Blind, are you? No. You just kind of camouflage into the wheat. You could make yourself useful. You're looking for the manure pit. Behold, the bravest of the brave, the scourge of Starling's dragon's hands. Oh, you're just going to eat grass. Who'd have thought? Who would have thought what? In the pond? No. You're looking for the manure pit. Witcher or not, you this... still to bust your bum. What? I can still bust your bum. Oh, here it is. And no one uh, noticed this stench. Come on. There we go. I keep getting Florence. I know it's a currency from the second game, but what is the first game? The second or the first had orange and Florence. I can't remember which one had which. Next is meet the merchant at the butt staining company. Sure. We go see the painter. 
Now once we go back to the city we can. We just wanna see the painting. I do so bad. I mostly just want to do this off quest, side quest. So I know uh, that one cemetery. Are we still the doing the six of ten for Liam and wherever her name was? Yes, but this jumped at the top. <laughs> Let's see what he wants anyway. Camp's abandoned, mm -hmm. but a lot of this damage is recent. Guess I arrived just a little too late. Should look around still. I'm sorry, but wine wars is important. Signs of a fight. Paw prints, beastly ones, that's clear. Just on this spot, though. Hmm. Griffin. attack. Must have been. It looks like a kitty cat paw print, so it might be a griffin. Yep. Scale. Colors unusual. No. Silver? Never a grand one like this. Grand oh, it must, it must be that white one. Oh. The one you saw the side about. Better. Of the fresh variety. Monster attack was recent. What the There's a dead guy. Weird white Man terror. Bled to death. Mm -hmm. Big beast inflicted these wounds. Clear from the claw marks. Must have a toothy smile, too, judging by what ripped his throat open. Nice. Maybe it's a joker. Gotta be. Maybe a basilisk. Except these prints don't belong to any variety I know. Just a little different. Maybe Royal Viper. Area's dangerous. I'd say there's a basilisk nesting around here. You'd be wise to remain at some distance. Yes, I'm familiar with the matter. And quite proud to say a basilisk does nest here. I look after it personally. Nani? Look after it? It's not exactly a pet. Beasts murdering folk who come through here. Just a minute. It does not murder those who do not trespass upon its territory. You post those warnings? Indeed. To prevent anyone from coming to any harm. Well, a lot of good they did. Got a freshly mangled corpse right here. Most likely a merchant, the poor bloke. Just today, I learned two traders had chosen this route despite the signs. I came as quick as I could to warn them. Too late, alas. I've instructed so myself. So this thing isn't evil. They shall take the body. Yeah. Return it to the family with a generous sum as recompense. Who are you? Fess up. Family is not the victim. Hmm. Pay the victim's family's compensation? Why? These lands have been my family's for decades. Granted to us by Duchess Ademarta. Beyond them... The basilisk ventures not, hunts not, it does not kill or destroy. Provided it is not provoked. Yet if it does destroy, if it kills, I compensate all for the loss from my own coffers. That's pretty cool. Hmm, your coffers. Got a store of sons and husbands in there to compensate for those shredded by your beast? Naturally, I cannot revive the dead. But I do make generous restitution to their loved ones. 800. Just last summer, I paid a leather tooler's widow 800 crones. This unfortunate merchant's family to be duly indemnified as well. Damn. That's harsh. Claim this to be the last surviving basilisk? How do you figure? The last of this subspecies. Their population was much larger at one time, see? Before the beech forests were felled. Mean to suggest a direct correlation between beechwood forest density and basilisk populations? Indirect, I prefer to contend. Beechwood forests are the chief habitat of roe deer, you see. In turn, a staple of the basilisk diet. When roe deer grew scarce, basilisks made humans their staple food. Enter the witchers. And thus, we've come to this one last specimen. Mm -hmm. It's a female. As recently as last year, we still had two. But your cast's mate passed on, alas. Your cast? Should she not have a name? My father dubbed her in honor of my dear departed mother. Your cast was brooding then. Two eggs. That she cast from her nest, alas, when the male perished. 
Why though? They Who do that. exactly are you? And how do you develop such an interest in the beast? Count Boris, happy to be of service. As to the beast, well, this subspecies is our dynastic symbol. The Desalfareses have for centuries signed with the Regulus Platinum. As family legend has it, a female of the species rescued an ancestor, a boy at the time, from a burning building. She took the tyke back to her nest, where she fed him as if he were one of hey. her own youngsters. Malarkey. To be sure, but beautiful malarkey it is. I wonder what basilisk milk tastes like. Yeah. Don't think about Where's that. Where's the basilisk nesting? Any idea? Of course I have an idea. But you don't really expect me to tell you. Those are not toy swords. I know your intentions. Find it myself then. Easy to track with its distinct paw prints. Mentioned two merchants. So I might also look for the other corpse. Kill her. I wonder, can we put something else here? Strange. These burn marks. Beast venom make them. Subspecies must be highly toxic. It is so indeed. A wound from a sterling basilisk festers long. Need to brew a potion that'll neutralize that. Busted barrels. Content spilled all over. Must have been tannin in there. Used to treat leather. Beast smashed the barrels. That's how the scent got on the scale. Your Coco is so very curious. Strong scents especially intrigue her. The barrels, they must have drawn her in. Drawn her to the caravan. What about Busted the barrels slimed with venom. Hallmarks of an attack. Basilisk must have caught the second victim here. Anyway, got two scents. Venom and tannin. Ought to be enough to track the beast. Why track her at all? Your cast is protected. Her death would forever destabilize the ecosystem. Who knows what would happen? I see unforeseeable consequences down the line. Simply refrain from provoking her. Harm her not, and she too will leave you untouched. I've long suspected they do it on purpose. Sent their goods. They seek to lure the basilisk to destroy their wares. It allows them to demand compensation from their assurers. And why would they do that? Yes, they get money, but don't they lose a lot more in the process? Yeah, probably. Like they lose entire wagons. And those things cost a lot more than 800 Oren, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to kill it, I just want to see it. Odors dispersed. Seems to be everywhere. Basilisk must be high in the sky. Blood stains. Clear as day. <laughs> you think he'll eat? Why is he following? You think he'll get eaten? I mean, shouldn't. If he's the one that looks after it by posting notices and actually not again. knowing anything about the beast. Is that gonna be the case? Just as I expected. Second victim, but relatively unscathed. Basilisk must have been dragging him back to its nest for later. Dropped him for some reason. Wonder why. Mm hmm. So somebody wants it dead. Mm. Uh. She's probably in the tree. Nope. something but it's no basilisk screech did they kill it human voices oh, are they trying to kill it oh that's why she dropped her food she got angry why is... oh reverse oh screw this Yamo, Harry, prepare the equipment base wandered off some ways we got to lure it back. And who might you be? Funny. About to ask you the same. They call us the Reavers. 
Reavers? Wouldn't happen to hail from Crinfrid, would you? Aye, we do. But how's it you know? And again, who the hell are you? I'm Geralt of Rivia. <laughs> Not your concern and neither are those things. You can tell him who you are. You're gonna murder him anyway. Geralt of Rivia. I'm a witcher. Know your brethren in arms. Bohold, Kennet and Desbrit, new boy too. Ah, you're that witcher. Aye, Bohold mentioned you. Said you swing a mean sword. A professional. Good, you came along. Could take on the brute together. Talk is the venom is something horrifying. Could use another pair of hands. Fee what we've gotten from the guild. We'll share it fair and square. You in? Gentlemen, this hurts my ears and pains my heart. You aim to kill your cast? It cannot be. The creature is protected. If you fear to lose the guild's reward, I shall repay it and reward you doubly to leave the beast be. You cannot slay the last living specimen of a near extinct subspecies. Willing to pay, are you? Long as we do nothing? That's rather novel. What say you to that, master? Far as I know, beasts culled the human race by five already. It doesn't yeah. need to kill. <laughs> Basilisk lives for now. We're not gonna kill it. A witcher defending a beast. Ever seen that, lads? You like them peaches? Ah, uh, no scrapping with filth today, it seems. But, but, you made some mention of coin, as I recall. I did indeed. And the word once given. Happy smiles. <laughs> Your share, witcher. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Easiest job I've ever done. Nice. Godspeed, Witcher. Strange working with you. Strange, but nice. Godspeed, boys. Thank God I'll they take the hint. Your custom. I thank you. And be assured, I'll take great care she not dine on any other souls. Gotta try harder. Figure out a way to keep folk out of this area. That I shall do. Master, you must accept more. Damn. Give me, give me. Son. Had you not come along, the reefers would surely have slain my Yokas. Um, thanks. Thanks. I mean, he wants to give it, so might as well. Thanks. Your cast has flown her nest. Must have sensed a threat. Likely to return eventually, though. She'll return. Always does. I suspect I might even know where she's gone. I tracked her away and believe she might have found a new mate. It's an ordinary basilisk, not a silvery one. But something might come Hybrid. of it. Who knows? Your cast could lay new eggs. Perhaps produce an entirely new crossbreed. Sure hope not. Take care. As long as he keeps that thing in chains, we'll be fine. It's not in chains. Well, with a leash. There we go. Oh, you want to go to the Gwent tournament? You have what you need, at least. I know, but I don't want to do it right now. You have to practice first. That too. Uh, which one? This one? Oh, they're all they're over all, there. They're all over there. It's all the Jacob thing is there too. Okay. Should I just run his, <laughs> through all these question marks? Or you can just go to the bridge, whichever one you want to do. I could just clear these question marks on my own time. Because they're probably just camps anyway. Not good. Why? Big feet to fill the fourth group. Something died here. Blood. Lots of it. It's not the basilisk, I hope. What is the tower? Kicking wars. No. Vampires, huh? 
Dead pony. Poor pony. Look at vampires, huh? How many? Oh, I hate that sound. Oh, was I supposed to investigate? Or does it just want me to walk across? There's some. Yep. That's some stench. How are they weak to? Um, insectoids. Fire and insectoid. You have insect oil. Yep. I think. Oh, have I? No, I need to med. Oh, never mind. Med it. How many do I have? Can I just keep stuffing this? Yeah, probably. Anytime you meditate. I have one. Oh wait, I already have this. Okay. No. Oh, I killed him while he was underground. What? Wow, he's Jesus. He's blocking the entire water from coming here. Now that's amazing. Come here, Kiki Moore. There gotta be Kiki no more. That's a big one. Yep. Because my witch is here. I can slap it to death. Kiki more eggs. Need to incinerate these to ash. Oh. That it? Or are the ones over there more? So, missing workers. This is what became of them. Oof. They're dead. Mm -hmm. Don't make me teleport somewhere. What did I just say? One day later. Nanny? What is happening? Yes, it's very nice looking. Oh, so you just stopped here for some unknown reason. Okay. Uh, night of tail. Oh, I'm well. I'm a little more. Let's go to the inn. Let's go in. In the inn. Let's go to the inn. Let's enter the inn. And win. With a green. Really? Yep. Hello. Don't mind me. I'm just your friendly neighborhood witch. Oh, that would be amazing to see a shared house. Just your friendly neighborhood witcher. Be like, hey witcher, how you doing? And then you just look at its background backyard and there's just a dead griffin on it. Oh, just regular waking up. Waking up to a grip and roar, killing it and going back to sleep. Cause that's life. That's Geralt. Where are you going? The teleporter. It's time to fast travel. Where are we going? To the woodcutter. Because all the rest of the quests are in that area as well. Oh yeah, I can look different. My witcher gear. Mm-hmm. I can be the pinkest witcher ever. I prefer you not. 
Just dance for Matt while waiting for cutscene. Don't do that. <laughs> Lamet, my friend. Is he can in go here? here? I don't think he's in here. No. No. I was wondering, can I go through it? That's it, Roach. Keep calm. Nero. I'm sorry, but Padaru is not in this game. I wish it was. That would be amazing. You've already put it in every other game. Oh, sadly, it got removed from Monster Hunter. It didn't get removed from Payday, I don't think. Uh, Unless the newest updated. update. I haven't updated it in a long while, so... If, if they still keep the add-on to be able to use it... You must hang on, milady. Hmm? Hello, go. Who are you talking to? You, Jacob. The wood. So, Heal, Mohot, golden down. teeth. Who asks? A witcher. Saw your notice. He looks oh, like he up. smokes some weed. A witcher, you say? <laughs> like in Louis Herrera's tales and fables. Luckier than a green bleeding leprechaun, I am. See. Not a soul around believes this tree is Daphne, the cursed lady of legend. But you, you could lift the curse. Aren't you a little too old? <laughs> nah, I'll go with it. So what makes you think there's a girl cursed inside the tree? Well, I came out with my dog, Moholt, to cut her down. Axe in hand, a broad swing I took. The edge burrowed deep in her trunk, and bum botch me if blood didn't spurt forth. Bloodwood. My jaw dropped in the dirt, but right then I knew every jot of it in the tale of Daphne, Gareth, and the Witch of Lynx Craig. Don't tell me, from Herrera's tales and fables. You porking bet. Second God, edition, I meant it in octavo. Those tales by heart. My nan read them to put me to sleep. Guess she read it cover to cover, colophon included. It's examine the tree. Let me take a look at the tree. Yep, Careful there's now. bark on it. Yup, there's blood. Swear I hear sobs in the rustling leaves. Seeped from the direction of the tree, judging by the shape of the stain. Dog. Actually does bleed. Looks like human blood too. Oh, it looks like her too. Yep, those are boobs. Scars in places. Medallions humming like crazy. Intense magic at work here. I mean, she got hit right in the private zone. There's other stuff around. It's gonna hurt. Logger was making good time. Strange though. Willows isolated. No other trees near it. I wonder how the hell she became a tree. And did you look at the tree close? Mm hmm. Actually does bleed. Pretty incredible. Looks wondrous. Did I not say so? Let's talk about my reward. <laughs> I never Willing bother with because I don't I really need where money. To start. No need. You kind of do, but door. not really. Miss Daphne and Sir Gareth shared a terrible and fearsome laugh for each other. Yet to prove himself worthy of her hint, Gareth was to face the Witch of Lynx Crag. Before Sir Gareth set off for the hill, Miss Daphne gave him her kerchief. Oh, a token I see of what this is going. Let me guess, he never returned. He did not. She stood here, day upon day, night upon night, trying to spy him. Till she sprouted roots and turned into a tree? Wonder why. I will fecking tell you why. <laughs> to await the moment when Gareth returns, kerchief in hand. That is the power of love. The power of longing. So you must scale Lynx Craig. Search there for a means to free Daphne. I will give you my book of tales to refer to. And good luck, Witcher. I get what's going on. 
This is like the Siri thing. Is it? Or the thingy in the swamp. Uh, the witch oh, yeah. gets uh, a part of the lady and she can use that. Uh, the witch can use that object to do anything to the lady. So yeah. she cursed her. That's what I'm guessing. Mm. But that's what happened in the swamp. Lynx crag. That does, don't say there's kitty cats in there. Or are they panthers? Come on, Roach. Oh, go, it go. wants me to scale. Okay, Roach, you're staying here. Not attacking. Doesn't mean it's not a threat, though. Why is it a... It still confuses the living shrubbery out of me. Why? Because panthers are black. Some are not. I've never seen any other panth uh, uh, colors of panther. Okay, I will help you. I've only seen black panthers. A hut. The witches. Geralt's here. Hut looks inhabited. No sign of the dweller, though. Guess I'll look around. Notes on the use of yarrow stems. Interesting. They can also be yellow. Fortune telling. Wormwood, sulfur, wart, scents fresh. I think she's here. Right. Mm. That didn't mm. mean this. A wall of spell enhancements or trophies. There we go. It was exactly what I was thinking. Uh, the kerchief. The doll is the lady, the branch is the curse, and the hanger so is the item. Monogrammed DF. Hmm. Could use it to break the curse if it's Daphne's. None but feral cats stray in here most often. Yep, Yet she is here. I have a guest from afar at that. What do you seek in my home? To release that lady from her curse. It's a kitty cat. He does not like you being here. Already found it. Any you do not aim to lift the curse from the tree, girl, do you? That's exactly what I'm doing. What if I do? Then you had best know you waste your time. The old tales. Did your nan not tell them to you? Even I, the witch of Lynx Crag, would be hard pressed to overcome the power of love and longing. I'm a witcher. I'm infertile. I can do it. <laughs> what happened to him? The lady's knight. He ever make it here? Sagara. Yes. He came to sway me, but had a quick change of heart. To be precise, it came after the first night we spent. Had sex and died. He stayed a fair while. Then his conscience got the better of him, and he resolved to return to his beloved. The Might have resolved to, but never made it. A tragic fate befell him along the way. You have anything to do with this turn of fate? Of course. Was I to let another woman have a man who belonged to me? <laughs> I could not abide it. I can lift the curse myself. <laughs> mm -hmm. I, I don't know. I'll try. I'll handle the curse myself, without your help. Go right ahead. I wish you luck. I have to go just like that. I could not have devised a better ending for this little tale. Our visit is done. Adieu. For never shall we meet again. Shall we try the other one? What? Uh, to tell her or else. She's probably gonna get angry though. And send the kitty cat after me. And then you'll have to murder a kitty cat. Yeah. Or do I go with this and then see what happens? Because I got a uh, quick save here. Okay. I first see if I can solve it. Uh, what if the quick save 
Will the quick save be removed or no? No, because as long as I don't okay. press quick save, we'll be fine. Okay. Well, the other one might get, but the one I clicked on quick save will not. Roach. Even though I love running in this game, Roach moves quite faster. Which is kind of weird considering you're a witcher. Even though she's scared of bridges. It's okay. I was thinking if I was a game developer, I would make the weirdest VR game. It would be but, you... like a fear thing. Like it would cost like only five bucks, but there would be like 10 things. Like one would be you crawl in a vent in VR with bunch of you spiders. You know they've already made this, right? What? Like, like a whole that... test fear thing? Yeah. First you crawl in a vent with spiders, then you walk into a room with bees, then you fall into Why a bees? Because people don't like them. Or wasps, that's a better option. Mm, should we talk to this guy? And then you fall into water with shark coming towards you. So? You met the witch, you must have. What did you learn? This is bad, but... Number two, yeah. That witch? She's not near as bad as folks say. Made me bow and scrape, sure. But I know some sorceresses witchier than her. <laughs> Joyous <laughs> bleeding news, but what about Daphne? Daphne's kerchief. We'll use it to lift the curse. But we gotta start at the right time. When the hour comes, I'll light four fires for the four winds. Then begin the ritual. Fires? Then I shall be of use to you after all. Seems you need wood. Much of it. Chop as much as you can. I'll see to the rest. How does the doggo help in the cutting of He's wood? gonna sit here. He's motivational dog. <laughs> it's like a I've Greek and god. The wood. What now? My turn. Gotta light fires and talk to the woman enchanted in the tree. No idea how this will turn out. So just in case, stand at a distance. Oh, she'll retaliate. You see me draw my sword. Run. Oh, she might retaliate. She might get angry at you telling your, your boyfriend cheated on you. Look your last to the world's four winds. From the south, not a word. From the east, no cry is heard. From the north, silent sighs. From the west, peer hollow eyes. Cease your vigil. Dead he lies. Let's see what happens. I hope this turns out good. Fancy. Hear me, you who hide beneath this bark. Recall today who you really are. Behold a kerchief, proof of your love for another. Damn. Spooky. Damn it. Run. Oh, it's the evil spirit. It's a banshee. She should talk to you after, doesn't Daphne. she? Damn it. Got it wrong. Run. Nope, I failed. Okay. Well, which one would it be then? If it's not the handkerchief. Well, doll or branch, maybe. Probably the branch. I thought it would be the handkerchief. Well, let's try the branch. God, I would love to be a witcher, man. Just for that fact. What? Being infertile. That would be pretty cool. Why should you be so lewd? 
but it's cool. Is it? Yes. You could make so much money. Doing what? Donate it to a sperm bank. Yeah, it's like here's a bottle, and then you, you are get... aware that's not how it works, right? Then you get uh, the money, the and then they figure out in the end that it doesn't work. Uh, you are aware they test you first, right? Dweller, <laughs> Guess I'll look around. Okay, maybe I should look at this other stuff before I touch. More than it. not at all. Library of Omnis. Should probably read the grave of mages banned this tome. Zhothagwa. And they came. Came from where? Bones ground into dust. What's in the pot? Warm. Smells inconclusive. No idea what ingredients are in there. It looks like a tomato soup with parsley in it. Notes on the use of yarrow stems. Interesting. Oh, it might be the yarrow plant then. Mm. So it might be the fourth one at the top. No, I want the third one. Wormwood, sulfur, wart, scents fresh. Okay, now, so now quick save. So I can just skip this, mm. or should I mm. test the other one first? Wall of sp uh. So I'm pretty sure, maybe it's a branch, this wood. <laughs> Probably but the it branch. It might be the doll too. Hmm, it wasn't the kerchief. Uh. Arrow. I'm about to say the branch. Let's try the branch. Branch of a grapevine. Could be to ensure a good harvest. No. Or a bad one. Examine the arrow. Doll looks like an accessory for casting curses. Arrow. Broken in half. No doubt to bring bad luck to the archer. Oh, I can't pick up anything else. Okay, then tell her or else. Silk kerchief, monogram. None but already found. You do not. A what if I? Then you had. Just leave the curse, please. <laughs> Should I be like that? I'll try to be nice about it. What if I asked you nicely to lift the curse, please? Gareth met the fate he deserved, and what happened to his wench was not. Right, so you didn't cast the curse, but could you help lift it? I probably could, but why ever would I? I'll make you. <laughs> I'll humble myself. Yes. I'll humble myself, prostrate myself before you like the Gareth of the Tale. Oh God, is this sex? I mean, that's what she wants. I beseech you to help me. Lift the curse that imprisoned Daphne in the tree. When I saw you enter I my heart, I thought, now there is a fellow who shall bend his neck for no one. Stand. Attention. None, not even I can restore to the last the years she has lost, can erase the suffering she has endured. We cannot bring her back to life. But I shall tell you how you might let her depart in peace. Yet my aid shall have its price. A lock of your hair. <sighs> how can I know you won't use it to cast a spell on me? I require this. I must, for with it I will cast a spell to conceal me from you for all time. And will use it for nothing else. You will nag me never again. And you've nothing to fear, I assure you. I always keep my word. Why can't you be a prick about it? <laughs> She's literally saying, I'm going to take a lock of your hair, just so you can't see me ever words. again. I mean, that's no problem. I can always go to a barber to get it refixed anyway. 
I doubt it did anything to your hair. Splendid. What do I need to do? You must convince the maiden her beloved yearned to return, but perished in the attempt. Take her silk kerchief and a fragment of Garrett's remains. His bones lie bleaching in the cave beneath this rock. Fire must consume the kerchief and remains. And remember, your heart, your intentions must be pure. Clear? Yeah. Thanks for your help. You're welcome. And adieu. Once you walk out that door, never shall we meet again. She reminds me of Triss or Yennefer. Her hairstyle. Hmm. Cool, that went a bit better. So you just gotta um, be nice about it. Now don't you dare touch me, kitty cat. I don't think he wants to. Leave it low here? Yeah, he's in there. Uh huh. And you didn't. You failed to mention all the like enemies here. Yeah. Hey, if you have the weird toxicity uh, uh, thingy in the uh, mutation, these enemies are friends. Are they? Yeah, because they increase their toxicity. And you do more damage when you're drunk. We have to find Sir Gareth. There we go. I think I found him. Uh, where is he? Where is he? No? Nope. Nanny? Did I miss it? Hmm? It said in the caves. It said a bone, I think. Oh, does this go further? Maybe. Oh. I didn't notice. Oh, you just went outside the way you came. No, no, this is another entrance. There's two of them. Well, it says he's here. Oh, there it is. Oh, there he is. Wow. How did it fall here? He probably fell in from that crack. Yeah, but it's not on this. It will fall on those spikes and impale. Knights plate armor and some bones. Gareth's remains. These them. Wonder why the armor came apart. Magic? Gotta get just back fall to the tree. Right. Lift the curse. Let's try this again. But don't do it. I do not need Avo in my life right now. You always need Avo. I didn't need in my life. There we go. No need of Avo right now. The real Avo is pretty cool, but not in this game. It just means trouble. Mm. I thought I could lift the curse. You almost did. You just need another part. So I still kind of lift the curse myself, <laughs> technically. So, you may that wit made. I can lift the curse, free her, by performing a ritual, making a sacrifice of her kerchief and Gareth's remains. But we gotta start at the right time. When the hour comes, we can skip I'll this. Fires, then chop as much. Chop as much.
I've chopped and stacked. No idea how this will turn out. And if you see me. If you see me. Run. <laughs> oh, this is how I was supposed to do it. You're Not on that. fire. <laughs> Screw this ritual. Look your last to the world's four winds. From the south, not a word. From the east, no cry is heard. From the north, silent sighs. From the west, peer hollow eyes. Cease your vigil, dead he lies. Hopefully this goes well. So now mm -hmm. I throw the handkerchief and the bone? Yep. Bones don't burn that easily though. Here Not in that fire. You who hide beneath this bark. The day of your freedom has come. Behold a kerchief, proof of your love for another. Where's the bone? Or did you throw both? Behold, a bone of he to whom you offered your love. Oh, there we go. And a marriage cake for the one time to come. Hmm? Gareth. Oh, there we go. My Gareth. He shall never return. No, he won't. Is his love for me gone? Did he stay true? Yes. No, no, he did not. Why? Um, he was bus He literally left to go bang the witch. Yes, but she told me to be nice about it. Yes, so, yes. Sure. Gareth remained faithful to the end of his days. He was actually, he didn't want to. The time comes yeah. that I depart. I've waited too long. I've suffered too much. And now I wish to go. Here's some ghost money. Farewell, lady. I thank you, stranger. And you, my knight. I thank you for speaking to me. For standing vigil at my feet. Even though you put that axe right through my crotch. Yay, we saved the ghost. I did not think it would end this way. I hoped we could revive her. But I guess it was not to be. Hmm. Did what we yep, got? number two. Happily <laughs> ever after doesn't often happen in life, sadly. You did well. Here, your pay. And the book is yours as well. I don't need it. Thanks. Take care of I yourself. I don't know even how to read. So long, you do? <laughs> Not this, though. Think. Put this straight in my head. Just don't put the branch of a tree straight through your head. A bad thing will happen. No, what? Doggo has a name. And apparently likes to hang out right next to the fire. All right. Now what's what? the next one? Uh, it's the wine thingy. It should be right next to this place. Yeah. Yep. There's one. Yeah. But we'll be back. <laughs> 